everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be doing a very quick Dollar Tree DIY and it's these adorable candle holders. They work really well as a Mother's Day gift. I know Mother's Day is coming up so I'm trying to give you guys some ideas for DIY gifts because DIY gifts are just so much more special. So I added these chalk tags to customize them a bit for Mother's Day, but you can also just remove them and they're really pretty to have as decor year round. And they're perfect for just outdoor decor in the summer or indoors. As you can see, I have them here next to a sideboard and I love that look as well. I'm gonna go into all the details on how I made this in a little bit, but please don't forget to subscribe if you're interested in more videos like this. I'll have two more Mother's Day DIY ideas coming up in the next few days, so please stay tuned. And now let's get into the DIY steps. So what you'll need for this DIY, they're all Dollar Tree materials except for the glue, and you will need two of these galvanized planters that already have the little rope detail on the top. Um, you'll need some ribbon for your bows, uh, two of these glass vases, also two candles. You can use the real or the LED kind. I chose to go for the real candles. And then just two of the heart-shaped chalk tags, some chalk markers, and some jute twine to tie your bow and to add a little bow on top of the tags. So let's go ahead and get started. This should be really quick and easy. First thing I'm gonna do is just tie my bow just to have that ready to go. What if the world had more of your smile? What if the wind could spread your love? What if your sweetness could reach everyone? There'd be no wars. Mm -hmm. Maybe the birds will sing about your heart. Maybe the trees will whisper the word. Maybe the sun will spread your joy to the ones who lost their hope. Next, I'm just going to glue the bottom of the vase to the bottom of the planter here. Then I'm just going to add the candlestick inside of the vase and glue my bow to the front. And we're almost finished. Now all we have to do is do the same thing for the other candle holder and add the chalk tags to make it a Mother's Day gift. And like actual magic, we have both of them ready to go now and we're just gonna make the chalk tags real quick and I will show you guys how I did that, but it's very, very simple. All I did for the chalk tags is just um, used one of these chalk marker things that you can get at the Dollar Tree. I try to like sharpen it a little bit um, just so it's easier to write with by just scraping it off and making like a sharp point. And then I just wrote the word mom and then I colored it a little with uh, the pink. And then I did another heart and I wrote the word love for that one for the other candle holder. And it's pretty much it. I also covered up the hole that there is a little bit of a hole at the top for tying the tag. Instead of tying it, I just glued it and I used, um, I, I made a quick little bow out of just twine to cover up that hole and that's pretty much all I did. And I actually forgot to show you guys how I made the bow, um, but here I'm gonna do it on another tag. Um, this is gonna be used for another DIY, but um, it's the same idea. I just looped it around my fingers um, and then I tie it in the middle and that's really all there is to it. And I just glued it at the uh, same place where the hole is just to cover it up. And I used just a very, very small amount of glue because 
I wanted it to be possible to remove these whenever you want because I figured even if it is a Mother's Day gift, you know, maybe the person receiving it will want to get rid of those tags because, you know, maybe they'll just want to use it as regular decor. Um, so I just made, I just glued it very, very lightly. So it's very easy to just take them off whenever you want. And that's pretty much it for me today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I will leave some information in the description box, such as the materials, the directions, and some information on how you can support this channel. So please don't forget to subscribe, and I will see you next time. Built my head with roses.